there are about 1.8 billion photos getting uploaded into the social platforms every day. There are about uh, 5 billion uh, internet users going to be there by 2020. There are about 50 billion devices that will be getting connected you know, through sensors and, con and IoT kind of uh, stuff by 2020. Now this gives you a sense of how the digitization in the world is happening. There are more than a uh, you know, dozen banks which are digital, which is completely no branch bank. Right, which, which kind of gives you a sense of you know, how the digitization is happening in the world. And careers do not want to be left out in this uh, space. If you look at the enterprise segment, right, 75% of the marketing budget for the enterprises is getting allocated for the digital. There is a paradigm shift happening in the uh, telecom sector where the forces like market, uh, being the regulatory, the competition, the customers, uh, preferences are getting changed and these, uh, you know, the, this landscape is kind of influencing how the digitization is evolving. The uh, communication service providers and network service providers of the current age are getting transformed themselves into digital service providers and that's where the paradigm is getting shifted. Now if you look at uh, the kind of uh, omni-channel uh, approach that they want to take to, to get into this uh, space, now there's a mix of both traditional as well as uh, omni-channel uh, plate that needs uh, to be played here. So SMS, MMS, USSD, which is the traditional channels of play so far, uh, is getting transformed into more digitized uh, with email, chatbot, social media, uh, you know, RCS, WhatsApp, uh, and or, or of that sort. Now each of these channels offer you a different uh, kind of use cases, right? From sales promotions to uh, lead generation to lead conversions, uh, you know, brand promotions and things like that. Each of it offers a different uh, value proposition, and each of it matters for the digital service providers to stay in the game. Now, Comviva being a player uh, in the mobility space, leader in the mobility space, is, doesn't want to leave any cornerstone unturned. And we want to be a leader in this and uh, you know, offer the maximum value proposition to the enterprises as well as the operator segment.